West Side, here are your announcements for the week. Ladies, you are invited to the WBC Women's Ministry 2020 Bible Study, Tuesday, February 4th, in the Assembly Hall at 7 p.m. Child care is provided. And ladies, you must purchase the Bible Study book in advance. The book is entitled Overcomer by Stephen and Alex Kendrick. February is Black History Month. Next Sunday, we will honor Black History Month with Generational Sunday. The following are our age and color groupings. Ages 9 to 12 are asked to wear pink. 13 to 24, red. 25 to 44, purple. 45 to 64, green. And 65 and over, blue. Remember, this is requested but not mandatory. West Side, we're getting ready for the WW Healthier Church Challenge. The official challenge kickoff starts on Saturday, February 15th. And just a reminder that the last day to sign up for the Healthier Church Challenge is February 9th. For additional information, email info at wbcchurch.org. The WHO will be checking blood pressures each Sunday in February. Nurses will be on hand between 9.30 and 9.45 and after worship service in the first aid room on the first floor. So be sure to have your blood pressure checked. The WHO will be waiting on you. The annual in-house music workshop featuring Pastor Jeffrey A. Williams of Olivet Institutional Missionary Baptist Church in Oakland, California begins here at Westside, February 27th through the 29th. This workshop is for all adult choirs at Westside. For more information, see Dr. Patrick Bradley or email pbradley at wbcchurch.org. The Social Justice Ministry is preparing to go before the LISD board on Monday, February 10th at 7 p.m. on behalf of our African American students to recommend the hiring of more African American teachers and principals. Concerned citizens and parents are asked to come out and show support. In preparation of this initiative, the Social Justice Ministry is inviting you to a meeting on February 6th at 6.30 p.m. in the 900 Campus Assembly Hall. Guest speaker will be the president of the Irving Carrollton Farmers Branch Chapter of the NAACP, Tony Grimes. Also, don't forget to register to vote February 3rd. Early voting is February 18th through the 28th at any voting location in the county. Westside, join us February 12th at 7 p.m. in the sanctuary for Minister May Barry's first sermon. Come out and support Minister Barry as she delivers the word. You don't want to miss this. Have you ever thought about how important your work is to God? The Bible tells us that one of the first things God did after creating Adam was to give him a job. It also tells us that most of the disciples Jesus chose were businessmen. For example, Peter was a fisherman, Luke was a doctor, Paul was a tent maker, and Jesus himself was a carpenter. Isn't it strange how much we know about the believers of the first century church, yet we don't know the occupation of the business person sitting across our aisle each weekend? The point is, here at church, we're all family. We worship and fellowship together, we shake hands and hug necks, but come Monday, Many of us negligently go our separate ways, while the Bible clearly instructs us to do good to those in the household of faith. Now you'd be amazed to know that within the walls of our church we literally have a city of business owners, tradespeople, professionals, products and services of every kind. Today you have the opportunity to make a connection that will change the way you interact with people in our church. We're putting together a beautiful, full-color business directory that will be given as a gift to every family in the church and to new members. It will be found online at the church website and across the web where the possibilities of exposure are endless. So today we need your help. Find this card and fill it out completely. Maybe you're an independent contractor, a professional, a hairdresser, a manufacturing or national company, a home-based business, or maybe you're a realtor. The point is, your involvement will help make our church business directory as comprehensive as possible. Every business person that turns in the card will receive a complimentary listing in our new directory. So fill it out, place it in the offering, and allow this gift to draw us closer as a church family while developing friendships and relationships that wouldn't be possible otherwise. 
For more information on these and other announcements, please see your monthly bulletin, the information boards, or the church website at wbcchurch.org. We're also on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube. Thank you, Westside, and have a blessed week.